Hello everybody, I'm Samuel Arthur. We are about to head on an adventure together. We're about to go interview Mr. Jose Tavares, president of Salco Restoration Construction Company. We're gonna get a good backstory of who Jose is and what Salco represents. I am super excited and I hope you're excited too. Let's take the journey together. I speak for the servicemen. I'm not just speaking for Salco. I'm speaking for for the Raphaels, the R and R plumbing, you know, the, the conversations as as business, you know, uh, partners that we are, you know, uh, business providers as we are. Uh, how do we, you know, we are, there's obviously a lot of things in relation because you know we, we, we work and service uh, similar individuals. Um, you know, how are you know what's working for them? What's, what what can work for us to not only sustain the business and. and having the business be fruitful and, and, and profitable yes to be able to be sus to sustain right because of course there's 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 stuff that um, you know when it comes to with operations it's, it's, it's being you know having a, a, a good team of accountants to make sure that your accounting is is in line so in case you know you're audited you know yes. by, by by a governmental agency to, to say hey this company runs clean yes. runs, runs legit yes uh, because we're here to stay because I, I, I think the biggest confession of my service uh, it's my word you know if I tell you uh, that I'm gonna get the job done you know I'm not only just looking to get the job done I'm thinking of how do I create a system where it doesn't matter if it's just a small patch on the wall that needs to be repaired versus you know an entire floor that needs to be replaced with new drywall and paint. Uh, we want to be that the go-to company uh, and therefore you know, this is where a lot of our time and money is invested in. Implementing these strategies and getting it actually to, um, how can I say it, to have a smooth operation it must have its own skill program that you've already developed and already implemented within your team. And, and strategize in each job that you do. And I, I cannot agree with you more on, on finding the right people to, you know, implement these great ideas and stay accountable for, you know, like you said, your accounting, um, the design team, all the main background of the operation that a lot of people just don't see. And that's what me and Jose want to really implement and strategize for Salco and for the rest of the people that engage with Salco is that we can now bring this along and actually show you, you know, right now we're actually headed to downtown, you know, downtown LA with Jose, and we're about to go see a job site right now. We're about to go see the day-to-day -day operation and the skill program that he's developed and the skill that he's developed over the 12 plus years. 12 plus years. And continuing more. Continuing to and learn. To learn as each development. I mean, no one's perfect, no one's perfect, nor, nor business. And there's always room to grow and develop more efficient ways, strategize, implement new goals, uh, new missions. So, you know, we're, we're headed into, like I said, downtown LA, and we're, we're headed to go see a job site as we speak. So hopefully everybody stays tuned and, and ready to see these great implementation stories. And thank you for Jose speaking on this engagement. You know, there's many more to come, right? Yeah, you know, I, I think, uh... This kind of lets you know the, the commitment that I have, you know, uh, the commitment that I have, and welcoming, you know, the criticism because a lot of this stuff, uh, you know, if there's nothing to work on, you know, it, it is putting putting your your pride to work too. You know, you're, you're a person that you take pride on what you do. Uh, you don't take the criticism and, and just brush it off. You know, you take it in. And you have it create as much as impact as, as necessary. You know, yes. uh, if it creates anger and bitterness, it's not good. It's not a good way to, to deal with it. So part of uh, you know the maturity that comes with it, it it's, it's taking that criticism where people say, "Hey, you know, who, who's working on this job? You know, a bunch of newbies. Like, who, who who's the new guys?" Yes. And 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 you know, we just need to understand that. Uh, the circumstances change, you know, uh, we, we are, uh, we, we are, we are well intended. So, you know, that is something that is highlighted as, as, as this company operated, you know, ran and operated. This is what this company means. It's, it's that 
we are well intended. Do we deliver every time? No. Yes, no. Of course. <laughs> Don't, don't let anybody bullshit you. Yes. Uh, it's, it's, it, the reality is that we have great intent. We are very service oriented. We are very grateful for the opportunity. Uh, are we the fit for every customer and for every client? We're not. Uh, and it's because, you know, I just, I, I pride myself in serving the people that value not only me as an individual, uh, as a human being, but also value our people, you know, our yes. people that are, uh, you know, this is what they do day to day. They, they sacrifice sitting in traffic for for an hour, hour and a half to get to the sites. Yes. You know, uh, this is the traffic. This is this is this is the traffic conditions that we have to face. Of course. You know, road working. So, you know, if we're expected to be at a job site at eight o'clock, we have to be way up and earlier before eight o'clock. You know, our, our day typically starts here at Selco between five and six in the morning, gathering materials, you know, gathering information of where we're going, what what, what are we doing for the day, what's expected, what's the goal, um, and you know, this is the kind of, you know, we want to invite you guys in into the operations um, with with the intent, um, you know, that we value each other. You know, more, more. Uh, I think we're we're in. A, you know, we've been hit through with COVID. We've been hit through uh, war now in, in the world. You know, I don't want to get too political, but the reality is 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 that um, the day to day people. You know, uh, it's been 12 years, and I think it's it's easier said than what you know the trajectory of, of looking back and you know. Uh, you guys knowing the individuals by name, you know, the Carloses, the Felipes, the, the, um, the Augies, the Elvins, you know, the, the Richards, you know, at, at one point, um, you know, served this company with, 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 with their heart and, and, um, and, they, and their intellect and their education. And this is what makes this company great is that, uh, you know, it's not a perfect company, but, you know, a lot of what you're gonna see is the real Selco, the real, you know, uh, uh, stuff that drives Jose nuts, the stuff that drives Jose, you know, you know, jump of happiness, you know, just to see uh, people developed, you know, developed in, in, in many, many forms, not just financially, you know, being rewarded, uh, but, you know, like, you know, assigning trucks, you know, these are all things that I know as a, as a worker. You save money, you know, like you save on, 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 a, on, a, on a payment on a vehicle. You, you save yourself money on, on providing, you know, your employees with uniforms. You know, they don't have to, they just have to maintain. They just have to wash their uniform, you know. These are all things that you may see like, oh, wow, this is pretty cool. But let, let us let us invite you in into the real Selco and what makes Selco uh, different. Uh, different and... A uh, pretty cool place to to to, to work in, uh, or the place you call work. For for some of us, it's a mission. For some of us, you know, I I invite you know uh, the participants, you know, into my mission, and and you know, obviously they devote the most important thing if, in their day is their time. You know, they're investing eight hours out of their 24 hours in this company, and that for me is not uh, something that's easy. You know, um, I am devoted to all the people that because you know, they're, they're giving up a third of their life, and and, and that's these are all things that uh, resonate with me. With, with I don't want this to be a flyby. I don't want it to be a, a half-ass operations. Like I want this to be part of, you know, this is their life and their dedication. So we're, we're here to showcase not only. What goes through my life, what what goes through my days, is what is what goes through the individual, you know. Uh, so uh, I hope you guys have fun. I hope you guys are are as enthusiastic as as, as, as we are. Yes, you know, both the, the, both. There's so many more ideas you guys are about to see. I can't wait, Jose. He's being being very humble right now, but we have <laughs> huge accomplishments and great mission. And I'm so happy everyone's gonna come along this journey. God bless you guys and, and uh, stay tuned. Stay tuned, guys. Cheers. <laughs> nice.